Yeah. What's up, man? man? I'm tired of this, boy. I'm so tired of these lame, boy. Why they trying me, boy? I'm so tired of being tried, man. I got to put that too out on these folk, man. These folk don't want to see that y'all. So I'm trying to tell you. Man, I'm just playing. I don't, I'm just talking randomness. I'm just talking randomness. I be trying to come up with different ways to do intros every time. <laughs> I don't want to be repetitive, man. Anyway, mall vlog today. And then unboxing at the end of the video. We're going to the mall, man. There it is. Going to the mall and uh, just trying to see what they got going on here. Doubt I'm gonna see anything really new, but I always like to hit a little mall vlog because I might see some. Last time I saw those, those air raid, the uh, I bet they gone now though. Them um, because there was a JD Sports in here, brand new JD Sports grand opening. They was the only one that had those jungle air raids. But you might see something else interesting, man. I am. I don't know if you want to call it hype beast. Let me get out of the car. Do you call it hype beast when somebody wear their shoes like a few weeks before they come out? Like, if you get an early pair, it's one thing to get an early pair, but then it's another thing to, like, wear them way before the shoe release. Well, that's what I'm doing today. It's going to be a super general release anyway, and it's going to be a lot of pairs. Who knows? I might get another pair one day. Might double up. Resale is going to be less than nothing. So I went ahead, black shirt, gray shorts, and I went ahead and put them on, man. Just went ahead and warm war war today. Just let them get some L. The Jordan 4 things, man. Yeah, Jordan Faux thing, man. Nike L on that ass. I already know. Is that hype beastish wearing my shoes early? I think we need to start reevaluating what being a hype beast is because they my shoes. I paid for them. I got them early. And I want to jump out with them early. I ain't doing them. I'm going to the mall, though. Things on feet, man. You feel me? Feel good to wear something. Like some OG sneakers, man. And um, why the chain mad? This mask tight. We'll see. Beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Everywhere you go, face sad. Like I said, there will be a sneaker unboxing at the end of this video. Um, a sneaker that I really wanted, yeah that I initially took an L on, and then the shoe popped back up. So, stay to the end of the video for the sneaker unboxing, man. Foot action is my first stop today, foot action. How you doing? See, so they got the uh, red Harachis on sale. They probably about sold out. I wonder if my wife want another pair, though. These hard right here, boy. These are, these are hard. I really like that Georgetown colorway going crazy on these. <laughs> these clean. They clean, boy. That's suede. That's suede. Colorway looking crazy. It looking brazy. Yurts. They got the orange Air Max guys in here. The orange Air Max. And the blue guys. And the black guy. And at the top, look, it's a bird. It's a plane. It's the OGs in that thing. The Air Max 3s. See that? That's OG right there. Air Max 3, hard, hard. Sitting, sitting. Y'all better start sleeping, boy, because when they gone, they gone. You see me? Oh, that man going crazy with the drawing one low, huh? Eh, not feeling the colorway. Look a little cheapish, a little bootleggish. Yeah, I'm good on them. They got them OG Ant Bed Stompers at Jimmy Jazz. Club Jimmy Jazz, that is. OG Stompers, man. What y'all think it is, man? Y'all know. Y'all know the boy, your boy Rich can't mess with him, man. The ATL ones is the only ones that I got. That's because I'm an I'm a ATL native. That's the only reason I got the ATL one. Cause I really don't, I still don't like this shoe, bro. Even though they the OG, I know everybody did these, man, but I'm good on them. And the blue one hard too, man. I might have to go and jump on the blue ones, woo! Cleanse. I was talking about these on my live the other day, how they kind of got the black. They just like the OG, the infrareds, but they got black, more black and like gray going on. 
be hard, man. Yeah, these is hard right here. Might be a cop for later on. Might be a cop for later on. So they got the for real joints. They got the for real BBC questions. Looking real ice creamish. And that guy. I think they kind of clean, man. Oh no. I'm trying to see what kind of fit you're going to pull off. You can wear these like once a year. That's it. Because they just stand out that much. And they also got the green guys over here. Which in person? In person, I think I like the green better, bro. I don't know if I can pull them off, though. They real Easterish, man. <laughs> Y'all come below and let me know the materials are. The materials are exquisite. I think this is a women's. Yeah, it's a women's. It kind of look like those, uh, it's in the same same vein as those uh, sixes that I just unboxed, the singles day. So I don't know if these are called singles days, but, um, you know, for the women, man, I'm thinking here. Y'all gonna stop being disrespectful to the OG. They in Foot Locker too. They in Foot Locker too. Stop being disrespectful. Stop it. Stop it. They look like they got the jungle vibes going on with the, uh, Air Max ones too. A little jungle print on the inside. I feel like I miss these. This is like definitely Air Max 95 neon inspired right here. I had to miss them because they already 99. They got like an 800 number or something on the inside of them. I don't know what's going on with that. These kind of hard right here. I ain't even gonna care. I kind of, yeah. Kind of digging them, but the Air Max 90 going in, boy. Air Max 90's been going in lately, man. OG stepping. Yes, sir. Oh, man, I'm gonna have to get my daughter some of these, man. See if they got these on her side right quick. Oh, uh, that's a 10, I need a 11. See if they got these on her side. So after that last video, these did pretty much sell out. These are her last two sizes. Like somebody tried this one on. It is a nine. Yeah, y'all came and got these. I don't know if it was called a video or a couple people just came out here. Eight and a half and a nine. I'm sure that every other store gonna get them too. I think I'm gonna get these, but probably later on down the line. If they would have had my size in here today, I probably would have caught. Still a clean shoe, classic 90s vibes going on on them. To me, all the LeBrons are trying to kind of run together. They all kind of look the same. These actually look like some Adidas basketball shoes more than some LeBron. Uh, I mean, they look like LeBron's, but more than Nikes, you know what I'm saying? Like, like they have some Adidas designers. Like, I mean, at the end of the day, just, they just, they just basketball shoes, man. Like, mm, ain't nobody doing these casual. So, this goes to show you how long it's been since I've been to GameStop. The dude, so I was gonna go in there and do a prank. Not really a prank, but I was gonna ask them if they had PS5s, which I know they didn't, and see what their response was, but, the dude told me that this GameStop has been closed ever since uh, they locked everything down for the pandemic, so I didn't know that. <laughs> GameStop in my mall is gone, bro. And I doubt that this coming soon surprise just for you is going to be a video game store. Somehow I doubt that. Apparently nobody told me that it was going to be rain today this is news to me this is crazy it looks like it's gonna be some weather man now i know i parked on this i know i parked on this road somewhere oh there i am right there yes sir Ooh, my baby looking cleansed today my baby looking cleansed i gotta go pick up my daughter and um I want to go get it before the rain hit. So y'all wish me luck. I'm here to pick up my daughter now. I made it, no rain yet. So hopefully I can get back to the house. I just got my car detailed yesterday and I do not want it to get rained on and dirt popping all out the ground and stuff like that. I'm gonna try to see if I can do a bow with my daughter. I'm gonna try to see if I can do it. All right, y'all ready? <laughs> bow! <laughs> there you are. There you are, pretty. Hi. See, hello. Hello. How you doing today, babe? Good. You doing good? Uh huh. Hey, miss you. I miss you, daddy. <laughs> Why you keep looking at yourself? 
You don't know? You ready to go home? You are? Me too. It's time, ain't it? Yeah. Time to go home. I like your pants. They got panda, panda bears on the knees. <laughs> they look like cats. They look like cats? Mm -hmm. They do look like cats. But they're not. They're panda bears. They're pandas. They're cats. They, they pandas. <laughs> Those are pandas. You don't think so? Because it's a panda on your shirt too, right? Yep. Panda. Panda, panda, panda. So you ready to go home? Yeah. Me too. You had a good time? Mm -hmm. You had fun? Mm -hmm. I like your hat, Daddy. You like my hat? Mm -hmm. Why, thank you, Harley. Mm -hmm. I appreciate it. I like your shirt, Daddy. You like my shirt too? Uh-huh. Well, I appreciate that too, baby. <laughs> All right, let's go home, okay? What you think? Let's do it. <laughs> Say, do it. <laughs> so, I'm at McDonald's, right? Hi. My baby wanted a Happy Meal. She said, Daddy, can I have McDonald's? Didn't you? Mm-hmm. You want a cheeseburger, didn't you? So. And french fries and apples in a toy. French fries and apples in a toy. You got so many of those toys. It's ridiculous. But look. <laughs> this your one McDonald's, okay? okay. For the week. So, I had a lot of McDonald's, like, I had a lot of McDonald's a week. You have one McDonald's a week. But anyway, um, uh, I wanted a smoothie, and of course, not only the ice cream machine don't never work, but the smoothie machine don't never work. Why McDonald's? Why? <laughs> and she tried to explain to me why it didn't work. You sleeping? Mm -hmm. You are? You gonna take a nap when you get home? Huh? You gonna take a nap when you get home? Yeah. Yeah, right. Okay. So, I am upset right now. Because on top of them ice creams and the smoothie machine not working. And there ain't not a lot of french fries. Right. This is all the fries. She's just dumped her fries out. Of her carton, and this is all the fries they gave my baby, and they're not fresh. Okay. Let me see them. She's good. So I haven't put good enough, so my daddy's upset if I don't get enough. But they didn't give me enough. See? They didn't give her enough. <laughs> Doesn't that suck? Are you okay though? Mhm. Mm you got apple slices. They're better, they are better for you than french fries anyway, more healthy. Okay? Okay. That is going to go do an uh, unboxing video, so I'll be right back, okay? Okay. You good with watching Ryan right here? Mm-hmm. All right. I'll be back. Okay. Love you. I love you too. And <laughs> bye, everyone. <laughs> so, we did make it home. We made it past the rain. Started sprinkling a little bit, but I finally got to the house, man. <sighs> finally could do the unboxing. Um... My little girl, about them fries, McDonald's. When I tell you, you finna, you're not finna give my baby eight french fries. You're not gonna do that. I'm gonna have to, you gotta check your bag before you leave. Anyway, so this is a Nike pair, and I didn't get them all sneakers out. They released those sneakers out, and then my size sold out like that. They had other sizes available, and then my size popped back, back up on the regular Nike app, so I caught from that app. And then they popped, my size popped back up on sneakers out. So I'm like, go ahead, people sleeping on this shoe because if people weren't sleeping on this shoe like they are, I wouldn't be able to cop. And I was a little nervous at first when they start releasing this silhouette at the beginning of the year again because they were selling out like everything, every other Nike product. So anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this box with these hands. I couldn't go up in the sneaker room because I want to be closer to my daughter down here since her mommy is not here right now I had to um, stay downstairs and she's right inside that door right there so let's go ahead and get the, a look at these man actually glad people are sleeping on this shoe it's very refreshing to me because at the beginning of the year um, the first the first colorway they released of this shoe was the uh, Air Max, I mean Air Presto 
Um, as soon as I said Presto, everybody left. <laughs> the Presto Comet Red released and it sold out like all online. Even that shoe is now, now that everybody is getting their stock in, even that shoe is sitting. So, um, but this one right here, I got a size large, which is, which is 11, between 11 and a 13 men's. Uh, so be, we gotta be real careful with these Prestos because they got the t-shirt sizes, man, and I wanted this shoe. The large was gone as soon as they dropped. The large was gone like that. Actually, they made me put my address and my payment information back in on sneakers, and then after that, it was gone. And then it popped back up on a regular Nike app, and I found out it popped back up on sneakers app as well. Um, so anyway, here's the shoes right here. For the people that are still here, pow, <laughs> presto things, man. I'm, it's one thing I like about Presto, that's what I enjoyed about Prestos. I hate the fact that they don't put tissue paper inside the shoe because it make it look all flimsy until you put it on feet. But one thing I really like about Prestos is a lot of people not really own them like that. And I get to cop my size and don't worry about uh, um, them selling out too much, man. And I really like the shoe and I'm gonna wear them. So um, it's kind of off, it's gonna be like off season for Prestos right now. So, um, you know. It's a summer shoe, but this is the uh, Olympic joints, man. Do it say it on there? It just says Nike Air Presso, Dark Obsidian, and Comet Red. This is, the original Olympics was kind of like the same exact shoe, but the upper, instead of navy, the upper was white, I think. I never got that shoe, and it has like all those little circles in the front. Those little graphics in the front. Dopeness, red, swoosh, blue shoe. Um, and it's actually, this part is white. This is the only part that's on the shoe. This little piece right here, and on the other side is blue. I wish they would've went blue all the way around. That's my only thing. I would wish this part would've been either the gray or the blue, or even the red, you know what I'm saying? Just the white, just that one white piece is kind of differentiated from everything else. Got these little dots on the back. I don't know what that means. I love the fact that you got the like, the Nike Air on the, I mean, I mean, just like the swoosh in the air. It don't even say Nike, it's just a swoosh. Just like how subtle that is. And then they super comfortable. I remember when everybody was jumping, so you got the USA for the Olympics. I remember when everybody was jumping on like Ultra Boots and stuff like that, and they was comparing, saying the Ultra Boots way better than the Presto. And I've always stuck with the way the Presto look on feet is just killing the Ultra Boots. But that's just my humble opinion. I know there's a lot of Adidas heads out there that's gonna say different, man. But that's it, man. That's my little unboxing. Did get a size large, which is, which is a men's, between a men's 11 and a 13. And it fits perfect for a size 12 to me, in my humble opinion. Um, I like the shoe. Like I said, I love the USA logo right there. Uh, I love the red Nike swoosh. I love the little subtle hits of uh, uh, air on the back. You got a Nike swoosh on the uh, medial side as well, man. Just a fast shoe, in my humble opinion. Um, everybody be like, Mike reaching them damn Prestos again. But, and then you got a Presto on the inside. Of course, it does say Presto right down the inside. And it's crazy because when off-white Prestos drop, everybody wanted that shoe. When off-white Prestos drop, everybody wanted it. And then you even had a lot of people saying, I don't mess with Presto, but the off-white Presto clean the hell. That's like the best Presto ever. And it's a dope Presto, which I don't have, which is crazy, it was so hard for me to get. I don't have no off-white Prestos, I tried. I like the OGs better than all of them, but they going for like $2,000 now. And the um, the other off-white Prestos, the all-white ones and the all-black ones, they going for crazy ridiculous resale price, two, seven, eight, nine hundred dollars so. I probably, needless to say, I probably won't ever own an off-white Presto, but I do have a lot of Prestos in my collection. For the people who are in the Prestos, uh, y'all can comment below if you want me to do a Presto collection. I'll just show all my Prestos that I got. And um, that'll be a good video for probably about the 5,000 that'll watch that. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, I appreciate y'all for watching. Y'all comment below. I know there's gonna people be like, Rich, you don't like the OG uh, air more up tempo, but you like them Presto. And that's the good thing about the sneaker community, man. You like what you like and you don't care what nobody say. That's the good thing. Can y'all just, everybody just please like what they like and don't care what nobody else say about what you like. Can we please do that? Um, but anyway, that's the, ooh, them thing clean, boy. I would do on feet, but I change, I uh, say that for another video. This has been a long video already. I gotta go back here and tend back to my daughter. So anyway, I appreciate y'all for watching. Shoe check one more time. Like I said, got them things on today. Them things. Fire Reds. Anyway, I appreciate y'all for watching this video. Y'all hit the thumbs up, like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Hit the notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up to the moon on them. You feel me? And keep watching my video, because that's what I'm here for. Gone. Mike, Rich, no hype, just kicks. Jordan, six, eight and nine, fit. Hottest, trends, clank, clank, cleanse, bless. Yes, I'm rich, M, I K E, you know me, OG, only, real, no phony, ATL, homie, shot my boy T, YFHB, Icy Mint Freeze, on my free throw line threes, Mike, rich, no 
No hype, just kick. Jordan, six. In my eight and nine fit. Yeah.